If you guys want to learn how to quick stop in NBA 2K21 current gen, you guys came to the right video, y'all. I'm gonna show you guys three ways to quick stop in NBA 2K21 current gen. It's so simple, and you're gonna be the most ungarbable person on the court with this move. Make sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. Let's get straight to the video, y'all. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy CJ, aka No Limit CJ. Welcome and welcome back to the channel. If you're first time watching me, listen, listen. Make sure to hit the subscribe button, man. Hit it with notifications. We are on the road to 6,000 subscribers. Y'all see the sub count right now? Y'all see? It. I know y'all see it on the screen. Make sure to subscribe button. It looks, it's just gonna look even more better when you subscribe. Also, make sure to like and comment. It helps our videos get further. And also, I respond to every comment, you know. So like, make sure to comment. I respond as fast as I can. You know what I'm saying? I go for every comment to respond. But enough talking. Let's get straight to the mic core. I'm gonna show you guys, you know, what you guys need to do. Here we are, y'all. We're in the mic court. Basically, you're not gonna need any um specific animations, but you are gonna need a 80 ball control to be able to do some of these moves so just know that you um unless you don't have like pro dribble moves you cannot do these moves but you don't need any specific pro dribble moves if that makes sense you know what i'm saying just, just hop into my court i'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do these moves also i recommend doing a personal workout because you can just shoot and dribble as many times as you want you know what i'm saying while the defender is actually on you it's easy it's, it's better to do these moves and practice when a defender is on you so you know like how to do it and when to do it all right, y'all, let's get straight to the, you know, quick stop tutorial. So I'm going to show you guys three different ways how to do it. I'm putting my controller cam up just so you guys know how to do it. Let me let me get a light for that real quick. But listen, I'm going to show you guys three moves right now. And the first one is actually the most simple one. So basically, you're just tapping LT. I know I'm doing a lot of combos right now. You guys can tune into dribble tutorial if you want. But um, basically, I'm doing a lot of combos right now. But basically, the move that we're going to go into is the LT quick stop. So it's, it's really simple. You basically just run and just tap LT and shoot it. It's really as simple as that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to do it a couple more times for y'all and show you guys exactly how to do it. But it's, it's very simple. Like, I, honestly, like a kid could do this. So I'm going to put it in slow motion. I know my thing's a little bit delayed, my gameplay. But all you're really doing is tapping LT whenever you're ready to shoot it and just shoot. It. That's all you got to do. That's really all you got to do. Once you tap L2, it's going to make you like do that stop animation as you guys just seen. And you just shoot the ball whenever you're ready shoot the ball whenever you're ready and like i said this is like you know a combination you gotta have good shot selection to know when to do this one because this is not the fastest one in this video but this is definitely the most easy i thought i'd start off easy just for you guys just to start off you know get the hang of it and then i'm gonna show you guys two other ones that are a little bit more complicated the second quick stop doesn't really have a name i just call it the pit stop you know what i'm saying because you stop dead like in your tracks dead in your tracks so basically all it is to it as you guys can see i'm gonna demonstrate it for y'all real quick you guys see i stopped dead in my tracks it's kind of like 2k20s you know what i'm saying you kind of just stop dead in your place and you just shoot the ball it's it's so bro this is the best one honestly in my opinion this is the best one in this video because you could just do it out of any situation but starting off i'll get in practice of getting this move right here if you guys get this animation right here you're doing it right so basically as you guys can see i'm running to like for instance i'm running to the right side and flicking the right the right stick left and holding and flicking the right stick left and it's vice versa for the left side you run to the left and flip the right stick right but once y'all get in the habit of it you just shoot in the middle of it just shooting practice shooting in the middle of it and basically that's how you just do that little quick stop i'm gonna slow it down for you guys right now let me know if i'm going too fast by the way in the comment section let me know if this one was too fast i can slow down my tutorials in the future but i just want to know if i'm like i'm getting in to depth it more i try to i try to make it quick but also like in depth you know what i'm saying but this is the way you do it basically in slow motion don't you don't have to do the speed boost if you guys don't want to but it's helpful with the speed boost you basically um if you're going to the right side like i said you flick the right stick to the opposite ball hand you hold r2 the whole time hold rt or r2 the whole time and just shoot whenever you're ready shoot whenever you're ready just get in the habit of doing that through the legs move first and then once you're ready just just shoot the ball whenever you're ready you understand so it's basically as simple as that you're gonna get the move bro. i'm telling y'all if you guys like practice keep practicing the move you're gonna get the move down it's it's all about muscle memory you're gonna mess up it's not like your first time you do it you're gonna be like oh perfect you know what i'm saying just keep practicing bro keep practicing anything you do in life it's just gonna help you so much more real quick before we get into you know the third method on how to do the quick stop comment down below active if you're still watching this video i want to know who's actually paying attention to my videos and also if i'm doing a good job i don't really know like how good i'm doing so you know that that type of stuff lets me know like you guys are still watching one and two like you know i'm actually doing a good job and like you know actually explaining myself so i'm doing my best to explain in the best way i learned i want to explain to you how i learned how to do the move but um just let me know if i'm doing the right thing so basically third third way to do the quick stop i'm going to go to the third way right now basically it's that step back you guys see it bro that's one of my favorite because you can get ankle breakers out of it low key that's one of my favorites just because you know the ankle breakers you can get out of it if you pair this with ankle breaker you're going to be open you're going to be able to you know get hit your shots i've done it a couple of times you guys seen a little intro too but it's just like it creates a lot of space if you use ankle breaker you're gonna snap them maybe like five like eight times out of ten but all it is to it you guys know that little step back 
you like if you like are running you know it doesn't really matter which direction you go in either this is the one that doesn't matter about direction but just get in the habit of you know flicking the right stick so i'm gonna put it in slow motion on exactly how i do this little quick stop but really all it is to it you're basically just you know um doing a little lt step back it's basically like the lt one from earlier but you basically just do a little step back first but if you don't press lt that's the most important part if you don't press lt it's gonna make you fade so what you want to do is flick the right stick down and once you guys see like you're in the middle of doing it you want to tab lt or l2 depending on console you're on and just suit the ball you understand so it's basically it's as simple as that it's like the lt one a little bit earlier but you just do a little step back first you can really do it out of a lot of moves but this is probably the most effective because you're not going to you're not going to be open on the other ones this is the only one with the l this is like it's better than the lt one because it creates space but that's why i want you guys to learn the lt one because it actually this this is going to help you with this one right here but that's pretty much it y'all that's pretty much all the quick styles in the game as of right now there's a lot more like drip moves and all that i can make a, I, can, I really should make a playlist on all the drip moves but i have it like in my tutorials so if you guys are tuned to my tutorials playlist i go over every move you see in this video i went over you know what i'm saying so go tune into those playlists if you guys want more you know dribble series and stuff like that i'm not even the best dribbler honestly like i, I, I haven't really been like this year i don't really spend like a lot of time in my court or nothing so like whenever i go to my court i'm probably doing like a dribble story or something but you know i do practice like in games like in situations sometimes these moves are situational though like if you're wide open for a shot don't go ahead and practice these moves go practice these moves when someone's guarding you you feel me this is it's gonna make you so it's gonna make you a lot better i'm just telling you right now it's gonna make you a lot better sometimes you might want to do these moves if you're wide open but i would just recommend doing it when you need to because these these are just gonna save you these are like kind of like safe safety moves you know like saving moves that the moves you're gonna have to pull out like once in a while i don't i don't quick stop all the time but especially when i speed boost like that um sometimes it makes you fade you know so you guys want to be rather safe than sorry and just do the quick stop it's gonna it's gonna make, make your gameplay a lot better i know i know there's a few people i there's a few people i know that don't really know how to do it so you know i i thought i would just help you all out in any sort of way i can if you guys want me to go over anything anything at all just make sure to you know comment that comment that down, video down below. Tell me what to make. I'll make it. You feel me? I'm really in studio mode. I'm in studio mode for the le next few months, bro. We gotta lock in. You feel me? The, the, we're gonna close out this year strong. I, I thought to myself, if I grind 365 days a year in a year, bro. If like YouTube's on my mind 365 in a year, bro. There's no way we can't. Like, you won't see something. You know what I'm saying? We were at 3,000 subscribers at the beginning of the year. I, I just wanna spend some light real quick. We were at 3,000 subscribers at the beginning of the year, and look where we are now. You feel me? We're about to close in on 6K. We're going for 6K by uh, March. No, May. My fault. May. We're going for 6K by May. But I mean, no goal. If a goal doesn't scare you, don't don't go for it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, no, that's not true. But I'm saying like your goals should scare you. Your dreams should scare you. So keep going. If your dreams scare you, that's that means you're doing the right thing. Keep going, bro. Keep grinding. Do what you do. What you gotta do. Spread a little bit of light. You know, things that I want to hear around me. Things I want to hear in my circle. But thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to hit the like button, comment down below, subscribe, and share. Do what you gotta do. Let's try to get this video to 30 likes. I'll just go for 30 likes and, you know, five likes from our videos as well. But just 30 likes on this video will be, like, very, like, you know, uh, encouraging. You feel me? But make sure to hit the like button, comment down below, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video, y'all. Peace.